Should we be in, under the American umbrella? Where does it go? I, I, something is afoot. I, I don't think there's any doubt about that. I guess Trump Dome was taken. I don't, I don't know if there is a Trump Dome out there, but uh, I don't know why he didn't go for that first. The, um, I mean, we did write about this not long ago about an integrated air and missile defense, which is the, the posh term for, for what we're really talking about here from a pure doctrinal position. And of course, it's all come about pretty much through Israel's experiences with Iran and, and also rockets coming from Lebanon and Gaza. So, but Iron Dome is, very, is actually quite a specific weapon type. It's a rather short range weapon, as you know, for, for the sort of unguided rocket attack, but very good and, and quite cost effective at taking out large numbers of these types of missiles. That's not the type of threat that the UK or Russia faces. We, we face a rather more sophisticated threat potentially from ballistic missiles or cruise missiles. So the, the Iron Dome as it's sold in Israel is not the answer. Um, but if you're going to use that language, then yes, we probably do need a better missile defense for those types of threats because the UK hasn't really had one for a long time, as you and I well know. Because I, I, I you're absolutely right. I mean, but it isn't just the Israeli experience, isn't it? It's also Russia has been firing uh, yeah. cruise missiles and ballistic missiles into Ukraine.